you guys know I get really, really excited whenever I have a clothing haul. As you can tell from the title we have a dress lily haul for you guys if you guys have been following me you guys know that i have shopped from dress lily in the past and i will link that video down below it was the first time that i ever shopped from dress lily so i was super excited because this time is a very special haul because dress lily actually reached out to me they wanted me to pick out some of their dresses that i can try on and you know do my my own review and share with you guys my thoughts on everything i picked a lot of pieces that I felt like I can transition from summer into fall. Without further ado, let me show you everything that I got. So, so the reason why everything is out of the packages and on hangers is because I filmed this haul before, but for some reason the lighting in the video was really, really crazy and it is now the next day and I have to refilm it. So realities of uh, being a YouTuber. Any hoosies, let me show you the first item. The first item that I picked out was this dress. Honestly, I actually like that I took everything out of the packages and I have them on the hanger because you guys can actually see it versus like when I shred them out of the packages and like show you guys and it's all wrinkled. But I don't know. Um, so anyway, this is the first item that I have for you guys. I absolutely love this item. I think it is just super cute, very, very transitional from summer to early fall and looks really cute when you transition it to fall. So this is just a black and white polka dot dress. It is very, very lightweight and it has ruffle details on the sleeve and it also has ruffle details right here on the bottom. It has real buttons that go right down the middle and it also has a little belt to cinch in, which I really love because that emphasizes the female figure. I got this in a size small, so um, let me show you how I would transition this from late summer to early fall. Look at this gorgeous summer dress. We are looking like a summer cutie. I absolutely love it. I love the tie detail on the waist. It really gives this dress some shape. The buttons that go all the way down to the bottom. The ruffles on the bottom of the dress. I paired this with a pair of mustard heels because why not? It is summertime. Oh, fall baddie so we just transformed into a fall baddie so i just paired this dress with some knee-high black boots because that is a fall must-have and i've also paired it with a cropped denim jacket which is also a fall must-have and we are fine 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 the next item that I have is this right here. It almost looks like a nightgown, to be very honest. It's very, very light, and it's kind of see-through down here on the bottom. This top part here is the only part that's not see-through, which kind of sold me on the item. So if you take a look at the top of this dress here, it just has like this crochet top, which I really love. I am obsessed with anything crochet like this. So I absolutely love this. And just like this beautiful V-neck going on with the crochet, I just feel like it's just going to emphasize and make our girly parts look so nice up there. And the rest of it is actually very, 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 very simple and plain. And as you can see, I tied a little knot on the bottom just to give it a little bit of a style. And I'm going to show you how I do that. I got this in a size small. The straps, unfortunately, are not adjustable, but it fit me fine. I didn't have any issues with it. And also just to let you guys know, the back here does have stretch to it. So it does have give which I do like. I'm going to show you guys how it looks and then how I would transition it to fall. I was not feeling like a summer cutie. This dress just didn't do my body any justice. So I decided to grab some fabric on the bottom, twist it around my fingers and then loop it through the middle and I pulled on and then I kind of stretched it out a little bit and then I took the fabric that was kind of sticking out through the middle and I just tucked that right in and then you are going to see it looks gorgeous now now i have some shape and just to give you guys a closer look at the little tie oh my goodness i am in love with the crochet detailing on the chest area it is so pretty so complimentary dressed it up with some white sandals 
Oh my my, well aren't we too cool for school? So I just threw over a plain pullover sweater over this dress. I tied up two knots on each side as you can see here just to give it a little bit more style. And I added my Steve Madden sneaker wedges to it and I am so cool. This is fabulous. This item I am super super excited about. This is actually a two-piece. So it is a shirt and a skirt set. I actually have the shirt on right now because I am really obsessed with this. Like, look at this shirt. So cute. I'm going to show you how it looks on paired with the skirt. I absolutely love the skirt. It's nice and long. The material of this is like slinky and stretchy, which I really like. And it's a pretty thick material. And it's very, very 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 comfortable i love that you can just mix and match so i could wear this shirt with a different bottom i could wear this skirt with a different top i could pair it together i also got this in a size small and um i'm gonna show you how it looks and then i'm gonna show you how it would style it for fall just to show you this cute shirt it ruches down the center i absolutely love it and it has the ruffles on the bottom and that's just how the back looks like and this is how the skirt looks like it goes straight down it is just giving me elvira vibes from adam's family and just to give you guys a look it does go all the way down to the floor i'm a little under 5'2 so i do have to wear high heels with that this outfit is pretty baddie already but you know what? Let's get battier. Wow. So we ditched the black skirt and we put on some camo jeans because I just feel like camo is great for fall. I don't know if that's in the trend right now, but I love it. I have some black booties on. That's how the back looks like. We a baddie baddie. Ooh. The next item that I got, I kind of slid in there. It wasn't a dress. But I was just so obsessed with this top that I really just had to get it. This top is just a white uh, off-the-shoulder top, but it does have straps to hold on to your shoulders. And it just has this beautiful like tie detail in the front here. And it's really going to just emphasize your girls and just make them look pretty. Even if you have small girls, big girls, the girls are just going to look good. The best part about this shirt for those of you guys that like to eat, that like your bread, that like your pasta, there's this extra fabric right in the middle. And if I give you guys a view of the back side of this shirt, so this is the back of the shirt. And as you can see, it's like a high low, but it's a high low going high from the back and low to the front instead of like what we're normally used to, which is like high in the front and low in the back, usually like when we wear leggings, but like, a shirt like this that's low in the front and high in the back is really just going to give you that extra fabric that dangles down in the middle to really cover anything that you don't want to show. If you ate a little too big of a dinner, you um, can really cover it up with this. So I absolutely love it. And if you want to show yourself off, you can just tuck it into your pants. So great for all body shapes. I got this in a size small and I'm going to show you how it looks like and how I would style it for fall. How freaking cute. You guys can see it in my face. I am in awe of this shirt. It is gorgeous. It is adorable. It is the optimal summer cutie shirt. I love the way it ruches on the bust area. It's so, so complimentary. And just to give you guys an idea, I will untuck it and that's just how it looks like. And that's what I'm talking about, how it can cover up, you know, your belly if you ate too much which we all do because we all love food, yum yum. But um, yeah, so we tucked it in. I have it in with some denim shorts, with some rose gold sandals, and it just looks like the summer cutie. So we took that shirt and we turned into a fall baddie. I love it, ooh la la. So we definitely had to pull out the faux leather leggings because what is a fall baddie without her faux leather leggings? Some black pumps, a long black cardigan and we are strutting and strutting the last item i am just obsessed with and this is typically like what i would wear on a vacation but it is so bomb that you can wear it like anytime so this is just long sleeve it is a high low dress it's short in the front and it goes all the way down to your ankles in the back and it just looks so elegant and so classy and so beautiful like you get that sass with the shortness in the front but you get the classiness with the high neckline and the long sleeves and the and the back just flowing down and it just looks absolutely 
gorgeous. I wanted this so bad that I got it in a medium because I'm typically a size small, but I was like, you know what, a dress like that could probably work. I was able to actually get it a size up and still make it fit. So I'm super excited about this, guys. I'm gonna show you how this looks like on. It's freaking bomb and um, show you guys how I would style it for the fall. Oh, Heavenly Father, thank you for making this dress. It is fan freaking Fantastic, classy, gorgeous. I am obsessed with the pattern. We have it paired with some white pumps. It is just perfection, perfection. But if you wanna change that into a fall baddie, all you gotta do is throw on a printed vest, put on some thigh high boots. If you don't want the vest, throw that vest away, it's okay. Put on some nude spanks, maybe a nude tight like t-shirt underneath or a nude tight long sleeve underneath and you can just strut your stuff in the fall. Ooh la la. That was my Dress Lily haul. Of course, I will link everything down below and I will also link a coupon code down below for 22% off, which is so amazing. If you check out the website and you're going to buy something anyway, use the 22% off coupon code, save you some coin. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys have a wonderful, fabulous day and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.